Hi, I'm Sean. I'm King Edward the Seventh. He's not, and I'm the best looking member of the Blackout, and he's not. And you're watching Kerrang! on a podcast, I, I suppose. Yeah, you are, yeah, if you want. Carry on. Kerrang! Right, let's do it. <laughs> Hello, and welcome to the Kerrang! podcast, day one at Reading. Uh, I'm joined by Sean and uh, Bob of the band The Blackout. You've just been on stage literally an hour and a bit ago. <laughs> <laughs> literally uh, within the last few hours. Yeah, how is it? How is it for you? In the words of considerate lovers everywhere. Uh, 4.5 out of 10. Um, oh, right. That's gone down since yeah. the last time we were asked as well. Uh, not because of the crowd. The crowd were fantastic. Well done, you. Yeah, you. You, you, you at home. Not you. Were very, you. If you weren't you, no. Yeah, where were if you? If you were you, thank you very much. You well were done, great. Yeah. And it was raining as well. Well, it, it, was, it was a mix of rain and the end of rain. But it's not quite dry. Right. That's sort of, you know. Wet. Yeah. yeah. And that's the one. Yeah, yeah. We, had and, uh, some, we had some technical issues. Okay. But, um, yeah, the crowd were fantastic, so. Thank yeah. you. Did they, did they get you over any kind of hiccups at the start? Yeah, we were meant to start with a completely different song than the one we started with because our intro didn't work. Right. Um, and then guitars wouldn't work. And then we thought we'd just give up on life. But right. luckily, we pulled through halfway through the set. Yeah, yeah so. it was slightly. And by slightly, I mean entirely infuriating. If we get and, uh, if we get more than two Ks from Kerrang, right? That's a poor review. They're they lying. They're right, lying. Yeah. Two Ks. So is that sanctioned then? Yeah, you sanctioned. Two Ks. Even if it says best I've ever seen the blackout, two Ks. <laughs> Any more now? I'd be upset. What if they'd seen you this one time? Oh, well then, sorry about that. They were amazed. Then it's they've two K- it's got a sheltered K- existence. I promise <laughs> you, if you're reviewing this and you give it more than two Ks, you're an idiot, right? But thank you. Thank you. No, we appreciate it. Thank you, idiot. Like thank think, you. We like to think we're all right. But we can be better. I promise you in the future we will be better. Yes. Much try harder. There you go. Excellent. So I can change. Yeah. <laughs> who's, 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 who is reviewing this? Oh, it's, uh, I'm, not at, I'm not at liberty yeah. to discuss that. He does not, that. You don't know, Simon do you? Young you don't does not comment know. on rumour and speculation. Yeah. Um, so you're, uh, this morning you're on Twitter and you seem very pleased with yourself that somebody of note had waved at you. Yes. Did you tell us who it was? No, no. When's this going online? Uh, t- today. No. Well, no then. No. All right, tomorrow. <laughs> but you've just lied to me. You've lied to my face. Are they famous? Let's just yeah, say. Well, no. Of course they'd be famous. It wouldn't just be like. I met a guy earlier, right, who introduced himself to me. You're a bit loud. And it was the sorry. <laughs> I met a guy earlier, right? You're too quiet now. I met a guy earlier that introduced himself to me, and you know what I'm like, chops, chopsy knob. Right? I met a guy who said, "Hello, I'm," and I went, uh-huh. ha, ha, "I'm Sean," and. Uh, 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 and he's moved on. By then. And that's all I got to say about myself. Was it Max uh, Boyce? Yes, that's right in one. Max Welsh Boyce. legend, Max oh, yeah. Boyce. There Thank you go. Yeah, yes. yeah. Rumbled. I'm, I'm very keen to know, but we'll talk about it afterwards. Yeah, yeah. Would it spoil a surprise? Well, yeah, yeah, pretty much. I mean, Ooh. well, it would ruin if this goes on the entirety of the surprise. To be if honest, if this goes on out before the end of tonight, at the end of tonight, the American. No. Do you really not know? Say right, this is brilliant. I know we're not saying we're not spoiling it. We don't want to be party poopers. We don't want to be the people. They're like it happens, and then everybody goes. With the band playing later. Yes, that's all, that's yes. all you're having. That's all you're having. No us. more. Definitely no more. After us. No more. Right. No more. Right. We'll end that line of in- inquiry. <laughs> right. Yeah. So uh, you you got the October tour starting on the 27th. Uh, what, well, well, what I remembered. Thank you. Uh, I didn't know that. No what me. What stops are you pulling out to ensure the uh, ultimate blackout experience? Some to all. Yeah. That's what you wanted to know. Yeah. Fade to mod. Um. We're gonna get some really nice lights. So if you like lights, come see us. Yeah. If you don't like lights, still come, come see us. Come see us anyway. Yeah. Right. Um, and and then subsequently develop a liking of lights. Cool. Are yeah. they varying wattage or? I think. Are they the ones you no, I think the, to make a look orange? The main the main oh. setting is uh, yes. on, <laughs> like the really yeah. bright. Right. I think so, no, he's bought dimmers now. He's bought dimmers. He's bought dimmers. Yeah, he's bought all the stops out this time. All right. We've got okay. on, off, and dim. Okay. And everything in between. Are they so hot? Would you end up looking like the members of Jersey Shore? Uh, I wouldn't. I'd just catch fire because I'm. If you look, yeah, I go. A, I go freckles yeah. and then no freckles. Then, oh, I'm a. That's I know, bright. right? I know. <laughs> it's, it's, very well. it's like a milk bottle. Um, yeah, because I'm. I'm a. I'm a big fat person from Jersey. Jersey as well. So yeah, I'll be orange. By the day one. Yeah. Day two, I might be like crisp burnt. Right. So. Um, yeah, it's gonna be. It's worth coming to see us just to watch me possibly die. I'm gonna let you in. On, I'm gonna let you in on a Kerrang podcast exclusive now okay. as well. Ooh. You ready? Yeah. Sean Smith just spat on my face. <laughs> 
Nice. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. How, how, how does uh, Sean Smith's spittle? It feels uh, almost feel exactly as moist as you'd expect. All oh, right. And as all other spittle, but it's unpleasant. It's like uh, being un caught by a windscreen wiper that you did hold that it's a squirt passes by. That's exactly. We, we, do you know, we had a we, van like ours. We've definitely done that before now yeah. on tour. What it lacks in windscreen cleaning technology, it makes up for in hilarity right. and pranksmanship. <laughs> pranksmanship. I think that's the first time that word's ever been used. Definitely. On this podcast today. I, I'm having that right. and trademarking that. I use that again. I'm coming for you. You better get on in Twitter. The, in the most legal possible way. <laughs> So, what bands are you going to be checking out later today? Deftones, please. Deftones. Yeah. Does this tie into your celebrity no. encounter? No. 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 Um, Deftones, 30 Seconds to Mars, My Chemical Romance are definitely all worth a watch. Not to say the offspring aren't worth a watch, but I'm. Um, they're the they are, personal they are worth. They are worth a watch. Yeah, but yeah. Deftones, apps. Deftones, do not miss the Deftones, whatever happens. Deftones they are, have been the best they've been. For quite some time, yeah. Like we've we've played some festivals with them lately, and literally I sat there and went, "Oh, I wish I could be as good as them right. one day." Ever. First time I saw them was this is this is a show, mind. First time I ever saw the Deftones was in I think it was either 1998 or 1999. I'm not lying. Ignore what he's saying. Um, London Docklands Arena. Do you uh, remember that place? Was there a young and up and coming band yeah. on the bill? Was it called Linkin Park? Uh, yeah, and a band called Tap Root. Oh yeah, Tap Root. Yes. Tap Root. Tap Root. Root played. Tap Root played. And uh, it was yeah, that was the first time I ever saw them. And then I saw them in Reading as well, 2000 I think. Right. And they've literally they they are they are better now than they ever were then. And they were good then. Yeah, they were good then. I was 17 then, so right. you know, eight, 17. So eight, yeah, he wasn't as jaded as he. Yeah, is exactly. Now. <laughs> and given up on life then. Yeah. But literally, the they will crush my spirit. Deftones are unreal. We did Soundwave for 30 Seconds to Mars. They were unreal. And My Chemical Romance are uh, My Chemical Romance. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. And we did that. Yeah, we did that. And we did that tour with we them. Did and two they were them in February, and they were unbelievable. Yeah. Melt, mind yeah. melting. And one every of, night. maybe one of them or someone else has got a hell of a surprise that's oh. going to blow people's minds. Oh, I know. Anyone over 20 is going to. Yeah. Poo. <laughs> there's gonna, there's gonna be, there is going to be quite a few people going. What? Everybody oh, yeah, under 20 yeah. is going to go. What? Oh, yes. right. Are the Chuckle Brothers doing a guest? Yes, that's right. No, that's it. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh. Definitely oh. the Chuckle Brothers. On that, on I that believe they exclusive. Are. I know. Yeah. To me. Yeah. <laughs> to you. They brought about. They brought a giant pane of glass as well. They're going to carry across <laughs> the stage, Ooh. and hopefully no one walks through it. Is going to run into it? I don't know. Who <laughs> you know? Um, so, what, what? Secret of comedy. <laughs> is a big pane of glass in a busy street. Or it might even exist. They could be just doing that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. The thing is, right? I actually saw. Tonight. I think it was the last time. Last time we went to London for some sort of, uh, you know, press. Try and make it. Yeah, we tried to make it. Do, Occasionally we go to London, London and we try to make it. We bring a step ladder and everything. Um, and uh, we literally saw two people crossing a busy street with a big fish tank. Right. And I was like, that's that. You can't really be doing that. You've yeah, got someone's got a skateboard. Where's to do that. their van with boxes of chickens as well? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And uh, melons. Yeah. Melons. And there's just a stall that's just full of entirely too many apples, and somebody goes through <laughs> it. Oh, this this could, uh, it's too it's many. It's got the makings of a Hollywood classic. <laughs> it has, is not it? Um, speaking of classics, this morning, because I was on the train, uh, and you flooded my uh, Twitter timeline. Oh, go on. Um, you were threatening to wear some sort of mankini today. Well, when I woke up, knowing that we were playing the and UK... the BBC said, don't. Yeah, and then BBC <laughs> Wales don't said, please do not um, wear a bikini or shorts or cut-off t-shirt. Because I thought, great British summer, of course it's going to be warm. Not at hanky. Yeah, turn up, raining, yeah, very yeah. badly raining. Yes, it was. So I ended up wearing my normal stage clothes, which is uh, fortunate for everyone at home, but unfortunate for me because I got a little bit warm around the crotchal area. Crotchal? Yeah. Is that a word? Crotchal. 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 Prankmanship. Next year. Pranksmanship. Yeah. Oxford English Dictionary are going to have like He's, two more entries. Well, yeah. if they allow symbols in, which is just a word that someone's pluralised incorrectly <laughs> just to sell meerkats. Then you oh, can he's have. Angry. He's very angry yeah, about it. Because it's stupid, <laughs> isn't it? If I was Collins' dictionary, I'd stay out of Bob's way. It's not Collins, yeah. it's Oxford English, it's a proper one. It's a big boy. It's a proper one, another joke one. That's yeah, Collins. Collins. <laughs> oh, Collins got a dictionary as well now, is he? We're good. They're both fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> other, dic other dictionaries are available. Yeah. Um, so, what are you going to be doing between uh, the uh, Reading Leeds weekend until the uh, start of your UK headline tour? We have. 4th Mer of September. We play Merthyr Rocks. Yes, you do. Our hometown, unbelievable lineup. It's us, 
Film for Friends, Skin Red, Young Guns, Mike Passion. I don't know if you've heard of him. So He's a hell of a laugh. Mike. He's a goth. Mm. Mike Passion, The Guns, Revoker. Attack Attack are in there attack, somewhere. Attack Attack. Cuba Cuba. Like, it's a literally amazing lineup yeah. for 20 quid. The thing is, the other day, the day before us, Ocean Colour Scene and Caster playing. Wow. I know. Yeah, exactly. That's There's actually impressive. Rip in this space time continuum. Yeah, you know. You go through that and you yeah. see Ocean yeah. Colour so like it's, what time it's 20 pound a day or it's, yeah, it's 20 <laughs> chris evans is just yelling it's 20 it's 20 pound a day or like 45 pound for the whole weekend which it's i mean unreal. that's berserk that's very i might pay point. it yeah. and i'm already in yeah. so yeah, yeah so, but so how we, big how big is it like it's like two big tents. Do they have to build those part of Merthyr to make room for No, no, we got, a, we got a castle. No, 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 we, we, we got a castle and a field. Right. We'd, already, we'd already burned it down. Right. Yeah. So <laughs> we just you gonna play from a turret? <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> Rampart <laughs> fest. <laughs> yeah. Behind bulletproof glass nice. and knife proof glass yeah. as well. We're going to get a poke mobile each. To me, to you. Ah, knife. Yeah. Um, yeah, we got that. And then what else do we have, James? You um, know. I believe that we are going to start writing our fourth record in September, We're beginning not. of October. That's again, not out. again, he's lying. I'm quitting a band. Um, <laughs> there's, an, there's, an there's an exclusive here. Yeah. Oh, December 31st, oh. I'm quitting a band. Oh, here's another exclusive. I don't care. <laughs> uh, <laughs> How long is this? I don't know. <laughs> as long as you like. I don't care. Yeah, I'm, I'm quitting a band and James is taking And I don't uh, care. I'll do it. And someone. Yeah. Cool. Can I borrow that? Yeah. Cheers. <laughs> Will all songs be about how you're angry at the word symbols? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, well, it's gonna be a concept a album. <laughs> yeah. The uh, the art the artwork will just be me stoving a meerkat yeah. into a the fiery pit. The album's called Bloody Meerkat. Yeah. Ooh. No, it's and gonna, it's got one of the things of him going. No, it's gonna be called Compare This Douchebag and me <laughs> smashing a meerkat into a volcano. <laughs> Uh, there you go. Other uh, meerkats are available. Yeah. Other, other small land-based mammals are available. <laughs> and fiery pits. And, are and, in, and insurance comparison Ob websites as well. Observant, uh, observant, observant uh, land mammals. <laughs> uh, meerkats do rule the roost. You went uh, observant, observant, observant. <laughs> You're a little in like inner turmoil there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it was before. Uh, <laughs> then we had to start again. <laughs> anyway, just, I, if we should just say something. Racist or sexist? No, we have to start the whole, yeah, the whole thing, again. thing again. We won't do that though. This is like the seventh time we've tried. It. <laughs> uh, thank you very much for joining us. Thank you for having us. No worries. Uh, this very nice leather suit. It is nice. Possibly borrowed from a, an old pub. Uh, <laughs> quite likely. <laughs> it looks like. Or a, a you know gastro pub. Yeah. Mm. Um, it's probably Sunday. It smells. It smells a lager. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, nuts. Nuts. I've realised as well. It's sort of. It's a certain shade of green. Oh. See what I did there? And uh, coming up next, we've got an uh, Incubus. Yeah, how good would that be? They're not playing. Cool. Oh, oh well. Uh, thank you very much for joining us. Thank you for having us. And, no worries. Uh, we'll see you on the uh, the road that is life. Right. And uh, if you do wear a mankini. I've all, I have worn a mankini yeah, in I've my life. Mankini. There's pictures online of him in a mankini. It's disgusting. It's not disgusting. Do not look it up. It's not safe for work and it's horrible. Can I just say, it was probably for a man who was about six foot six. <laughs> All right. Well, there was some falling out then. <laughs> well, there was a little bit of. I, I, say, you I, didn't I, have I managed the right to make of equipment to all I managed to make ends meet. Don't. 